Hello everyone, welcome back to Popcorn in Bed, Canada edition. If you're new here, I am visiting my parents in Canada. This isn't our usual bed. New bed, I'm doing a couple of reactions while up here, which is great. Just a little less paraphernalia. Just my angel, Halo. Um, okay, tonight I'm watching The Equalizer. We have a long list of people's Patreon requests on our website and they're numbered. So the most requested down to the least. And I usually do one to 50, but this time I did numbers 51 to 100 of our top 100 requested movies. Drew, six names, Equalizer, Gone in 60 Seconds, Twins, what else is on there? Rounders, anyways, The Equalizer won. So that's what I'm watching, so. To me, this sounds very like The Equalizer, The Terminator, Demolition Man, Predator, like all these like very like action movie names. Then it's Denzel Washington. And to me, he's, he's the coach from Remember the Titans, to me. I mean, he's a lot of things. He is pretty incredible in everything I've seen him in, but he's so not like Arnold Schwarzenegger-y action, you know, so, I'm, I guess I'm just trying to make sense of the name and him in my mind, which I'm excited to watch this play out. I, I actually really am. I know there's a few of these. I think there's two or three. Obviously it won, but then there was also some comments that were like, it's not good at all. <laughs> so we shall see. I always try to go in with an open mind and just let it take me for the ride. If you wanna vote in polls like this, actually right now we have a Hitchcock poll going on right now. It looks like North by Northwest is gonna take it. Here is my Patreon. And then don't forget to like, subscribe, hit the bell. Here's my Instagram, the equalizer. I don't know. The two most important days in your life are the day you were born and the day you found out why. That's pretty good. Okay, he looks like a dad, not a... Uh... Yo, Pop. Bet you didn't have to push no dollies at your old job, did you? Guilty as charged. Yeah. It's like a Home Depot situation. What you got there? It's tuna. Bread, whole grain, gluten free. It's a bone in the tuna. You want to make security guards, you got to lose weight, you got to test in one week. Now you ask me to help you. Progress, not perfection. I hate tuna. <laughs> Cool, Cassie. <laughs> oh, he's not even in his pajamas. Doesn't that just, in a bed, still in your jeans? Hey, is he not sleeping? The old man in the sea. Oh, I know her. You catch that fish yet? Jazz hooked it. Didn't know if you could hang on, though. Yeah, well, maybe he's just too old. But you're gonna give up that refined sugar. I am. When? Any day now. Yeah, bad for your vocal cords. Body, mind, spirit, remember? They're buds. She was in uh, that one book I read. It was, she was a violinist, I can't. We bet know what you did before you got here. I was a pip. What's a pip? You know, like Gladys Knight in the pips. Like this. Mm. <laughs> oh, the Wait a minute. Oh, slide the whistle. Oh, oh, oh. Man, that's him with an afro. He's bald. He, so he had a oh. wig on. That wasn't him, right? Why doesn't he sleep? Here you go, kid. Thanks. I'm worried about her. You ever catch it? Yes, yeah, you did. It's a happy ending. Mm, not exactly. Old man tied the fish to the side of the boat. Fish bled in the water. Sharks came. He saw himself in the fish. Came to respect it the more it fought. Why didn't he just let the fish go? The old man's got to be the old man. Fish got to be the fish. Shark's got to be the shark. Keep your 
یعنی هر چو یکا بود رو گوونیا You gonna leave me to die of smoke inhalation? I'm a buck 90. I'm stronger. Hey, don't doubt yourself, son. Doubt kills. Get up. Who's gonna make security guard? I like it. Let's do it again. That's the coach I know and love. Loaded with poison, just like you like. Is that your birthday? No, some guy at work. Happy birthday, some guy at work. How old are you? How old are you? Doesn't really matter. I'm sorry, I'm breaking protocol, right? No, no, listen, hey, come. Oh, I just want to give her a hug. Put her in some comfy pajamas. So? I don't know. You know, I just kind of feel like a quiet voice. Before it all goes crazy. I'm Terry. Bob. You know, you don't look like a Bob. He doesn't. Thank you. You look like a Robert. Robert reads books like this, and Bob watches TV. <sighs> My real name's Alina. What happened to your face? So stupid. Maybe he could get her a job at Home Depot. Okay, it's not professional. Just tell me what you think, okay? Oh, wow. Alina, the singer, I think you can be anything you want to be. Maybe in your world, Robert. Doesn't really happen that way in mine. Change your world. There's no ring. No Mrs. Robert at home. Was there ever? Once. Did you break her heart? It's broke my eye. There's more to that story. Something in your eyes. You know, it's not sad. It's just kind of lost, you know? She knew he was widowed. He's widowed. You always read books? My wife did. So we're gonna wait through the 100 books everybody should read. So I figured I'd give it a shot. And, you know, one day we'd have something to talk about. How many of you read, Robert? 91. <laughs> 91 books, though. What are you gonna do after that? Take singing lessons. And then I'm gonna open a donut factory. What? Why are you laughing? Oh, he's probably the nicest guy she talks to and... What's your new one about? Oh, it's about a guy who thinks he's a knight in shining armor. And the only thing is, he lives in a world where knights don't exist anymore. Yeah, it sounds like my world. <laughs> Thank you for the quiet voice, Robert. You're very welcome, Alina. <laughs> yeah. Catch you around, all right? Good night. Oh, crap. What are you doing, huh? What are you doing with Sorry, Robert. Ay, ay, ay. This girl, she's no good. Call this number. Better. This guy's. Right I thought he was gonna rage on them. When is the last time this man slept? Someone beat her up real good. Oh my gosh. What? Who could actually? Slavi was the guy in the car, right? And she got to the point where she thought her life could be hers one day. Slavi reminded her never would be. I said it got her thrown next time. I said a whore who fucks and can't talk might be worth twice as much. <sighs> That's disgusting. So he's, this guy brought her over from Russia. That's probably why she doesn't have an accent. He brought her young. You're lost, did you? I'm scared you are. Yeah. I'm here for that girl. 
I'm here about a certain girl. She got beat up pretty bad. I'm thinking that uh, maybe you have wrong address. Her name's Alina. No, it doesn't ring a bell. But whoever she is, I'm sure she must really know how to serve the Oh, what a sick, sick group of individuals. I can give you $9,800. For what? For freedom. What's my training, you? This guy gonna give me $9,000 for one single piece of I think that you can come into my place of business and just buy whatever you want. You f***ing insult me. What's gonna happen? Now he rages? I'm <laughs> just so, $9,000 or the trouble maker. One month. That's it. Think this is a one time payment? I make this off this girl in two weeks. That girl is still a child. I still can sell her as virgin. This makes a prime earner for a good while. Go back to your house and jerk yourself off 9,800 times, and then you come crawling back here to talk to me. She will be used up by then for sure. Maybe then I will let you have it for nothing. I wanted him to. Sp Okay. My heart is beating very fast. What? Is this like superhero stuff or just superpower stuff or just... was trying to live his life. Alina, the girl you beat half to death, our life's gonna go on. Yours is gonna end right here on this funky floor. <laughs> you should have taken the money. The cork. The cork. The corker. In the... Was that him being able to finally sleep? Test tomorrow and you're still eating that salty stuff. Open it. I made the wait. Tomorrow I'm gonna ace that test, Mr. McCall. What happened? Hit it on something stupid. <laughs> so now what happens to Alina is my question. She's, she's free, but she's gotta, she could. Police sources have said the killings have all the earmarks of a turf war between rival factions. So he must have been some kind of, I don't know, special ops, some kind of a secret hitman. Is this guy a detective or the head? None of our informants heard about this going down. Security system's hard drive was taken, so we're blind in here. Hopper. I want images from every security camera within a six block radius. Listen, pal, I don't like your tone with me. You've taken Mr. Pushkin's money for years. Money that comes with conditions, non-negotiable. I thought they were cops, they're not. you're having with me is you still think you matter. You don't. I'm all that matters. And so we're clear. I'm not here to say, please, I'm here to tell you what to do. All right, you seen Robbie? Supposed to be taking that security guard test after work? Calling and quit. Quit? No notice either. <laughs> But he was so excited. Heard you quit today, I got worried. My mom had a little accident here last night, a fire. So I'm gonna help out around here now. Need some help? Yeah, if you're not doing anything, that'd be, that'd be awesome. Helping you. He's such a kind man. He just kills bad guys, right? I know shit about what we're down, or who you should be out looking for. Well, Mr. Nune, I appreciate your kind It's refreshing. We pay you 15%. The additional 10% you steal, we ignore. You're a rat. No information, no protection, no assurances. Who the f*** do you think you are coming? Who I am is complicated. What I am, a threat. Roll this, mother... Oh, crap. Holy crap. Okay, okay. That's... Oh, 
Oh, I hope he's not the same kind of person that Mr. McCall is. What really happened in there, Ralphie? Faulty wire, something. We both know that's not true. Sorry I wasted your time, Mr. McCall. Hey, you didn't waste my time. Don't worry about it. You know, when stuff like this happens, I just gotta put everything on hold for a while. What was I thinking? I, I wasn't gonna pass a security guard test anyway. Slavi never did his business in front of the girls. We can't locate one of the other girls from Slavi's stable. Stable? We cannot show weakness. We need this wrapped up quickly. Whoever did this specialized in killing. Pretties, just find him, Teddy. I'm talking over a million barrels this delivery. They're not going to be able to find him, right? Because he has nothing to do with any of this. He just happened to be at a diner that a girl went to. I'm still a little confused about this restaurant. See? You pay on time, no more problem. Come on, let's go to the banana get a blowy. Hey, officer. Whoa! I'd like to report a crime. Really? Come on, let's get out of here. Wait, they are officers? Why wait city? services when I got two corrupt cops right in front of me. The cops are making her pay. How'd you get that number? Or they set her place on fire. When had the fire, same thing could happen to you. you. Pay like everybody else. How many copies? One. Yeah, you must have a death wish, pal. What the f do you want, huh? Those people you took the money from, maybe you should give it back. Maybe our best interest is to tie a cinder block around your waist, throw you in the f***ing mystic. Huh? Well, this is very disappointing. You're supposed to stand for something, protect and serve, uphold the law. Tomorrow you'll have returned all the money you extorted from those people. You'll tell them it will never happen again. You do that, and this video will never be seen. Don't. And a half an hour later, you'll watch the uncut version on every news outlet in the area. He's a vigilante. The other girls claim that you were very close to Terry. Please don't hurt her. Please don't hurt her. Please don't hurt her. When did you last talk to her? Oh, a week ago. Did anyone else visit her? Yes, a man. A man? Nice man. A black man. He wanted to know what happened to her. And your friend, Terry. No one saw her. She left us. Don't touch her either. I'm so scared. Would you like some water? It's possible. Sweet. Yes. Please, please. Mm. Mm. Hey, please. So the secret. No. Please. I can't watch this. That guy gives me the worst feeling. Oh, that's so tender. This person walks in the front door several minutes after Slavi arrived, but never comes out. Can you do a quick card refund for me when you're done? Gentleman's in a hurry. Open that. Register, I just said. Move, move, empty the register. Open the register up right now. All of it. Give me all of it. What's he can he do? Can he show his secret skills? Give me that ring I say. It was my mother's. Equalize him. Take it. It was my mother's. Now what? The guy's done for like this. Shot a guy over in Somerville a month ago. It's only money. Oh my god. It was kind of nice of them to not show me that one. Mr. 
a call. We're looking into a homicide that occurred two weeks ago. Oh, yeah, I heard about it on TV. I happened to be there that night. We're just checking to see if any of the patrons remembered anything suspicious that night. Not that I recall. You didn't stay long. I didn't check my watch. Is he posing as a cop? You know this girl. I don't remember where from. What happened to her? She fell down and broke her neck. Don't you want to leave me your card, officer? That's what you policemen usually do, right? He sees right through him. He's not scared. No, he's not. Everything about him is wrong. Like he doesn't think he did it, or he just doesn't fit who would normally do something that. This is what we have on Robert McCall so far. College educated, grade 40 at the home mark, bank statements, tax returns. Looks pretty normal. All lies fabricated. To take him clean. He's a little ready for it, right? He knows they're on to him. Coffee, please. Ten egg sandwich, two. On a roll. Is it just you, or are we waiting for someone else? If you really work the power lines down there, your hands wouldn't look like that. I know we got to be waiting for somebody else. He's got like the, um, you know, in house when he just sees things that others don't. Take a little walk across the street, me and you. Black Denali. Spidey senses. He is very good at this. He's smarter than you. He's stronger than you. He's just in his little button up. I think he has a weapon. This guy thinks he's so smart. That just hot grease? Honey. Crap, crap. I thought he was gonna throw it in their face. He's gotta know they know where he lives. Does that work? Seal up a cut, hot honey? They know where you live. <sighs> where was he? Travel items purchased three days ago. He's Logan, 10 a.m. tomorrow. I knew this was coming. It's not going anywhere. Watching us. Ugh. I want to know his backstory. It's backstory time, right? Who did he work for? What was his wife like? If you've come for my help, I can't give you any. Just came for tea. I'm not at the agency anymore. I consult on a few things, that's it. Just need to know who this man is. She knows. Tell me what's going on. Please. So he worked for some government agency. You know, when they told Susan you were dead, she couldn't comprehend it. She said, oh no, not Robert. And not from something as trivial as a car bomb. It's the Independence Day president. What's, what's going on here? the East Coast hub of Vladimir Pushkin. Pushkin. He's built an intricate network on both U.S. coasts. His money and political ties make him untouchable. Your friend here is who Pushkin sends when he's got a problem. Men away with the secret police for years, went private when the union fell. Oh. Basically, he's a sociopath with a business card. Mm. You know these two? Boston PD, probably on Pushkin's payroll. Three years. Detective Remar and Detective Petter. Those are the ones. Suffocated, testicles blown off and shoved down their throats. Third one, Detective Masters hasn't shown up for work in several days. Oh, he was police. He won't stop until he kills you and anyone you care about. So they literally know who Pushkin is. They know how horrible he is and they can't do anything about it. One day somebody does something unspeakable to someone else, to someone you hardly knew, and you do something about it, because you can. Sometimes we 
You make the wrong choices to get to the right place. I know a part of you died when Vivian did, but not the part she loved the most. Go be him. So they thought he was dead. He faked his own death to get out of this secret agency he was in. Were you able to help him? He didn't come for help. He came for permission. It's go time. The prey becomes the predator. Oh, he's gonna die really hard, isn't he? Oh, Hopper. Oh! already done like gonna give me what i need such a f why don't you get out of here go f yourself you i swear to god boston beat it i don't have a lot of time <sighs> just let me go just let me go i'm gonna let you, you go let i'm gonna let you go i'll be back oh crap oh crap Here's Andre. Oh, he didn't die. This is all so corrupt and backwards. This location been compromised. You got to get all your shit out of here. You got to truck it all the f out. The f I'm going to do that. Who's this piece of? Nice vocabulary, men. Can I see it? Oh, you want to see my gun? You're so nuts! Frank tells me you're the man, Andre. So if you tell them to put the guns down, lay down on the floor with their hands behind their back, they'll do that, won't they? Indulge me, Andre. Pushkin thanks you very much. We're going out of business. Closing down shop. Mr. Pushkin thanks you very much. There you are, sweetheart. Detective Frank Master, 1013 155 Warren Street, Rear End. I know you got an escape plan. What do you keep? You did this, you mother! You hear yourself, you did it to this badge, man. Disrespected this badge, you understand me? F you, you mother Oh my gosh. I'm a f dead man, I won't last a fing week. And do the right thing. What's the right thing? Police officer for 22 years, I know you didn't get this far not having out. Where do you keep it? I was a good cop. And then? Do it for the good cops, man. Where do you keep it? Is this his escape plan? Recording of the whole deal with these guys on the seat. Crazy, right? That was tagged to his jacket. Follow the money. Oh? Who's gonna f***ing count us? My gosh. My men will find him. Good. I got the pace. Oh, you're gonna die, I think. He's not coming back. Okay. Face to face, here we go. You can call your boss and tell him to shut down his operation. That's not much of an offer. That's the only one you're gonna get. When you pray for rain, you gotta deal with the mud, too. When you look at me, what do you see? I knew a Russian police captain back in the day. A famous scholar lived in Moscow. And even though he had five beautiful children, he opened his home to a sixth. The kid had been pounded by the system from an early age. So this good man opened his home to this boy. And when the boy stole from him, this good man loved him anyway. When the boy lied and cheated, this good man showed compassion and love. One week later, intruders broke into the man's house, killed the man and his wife. Things a child might steal, lay the off and chip back to hell. Just when he finally had a chance at life. It's a well-known story. They have a catch who did it. Maybe they didn't look in the right place. Sometimes the answer's right in front of you. Yeah, do you my chick. I think the boy killed him. I think the boy was scared that his foster parents would wake up one day and realize that he wasn't worth it. Was this the boy? The man I killed. Your man. I gave them a chance. 
They made their decision. I'm giving you the opportunity to make yours. Of course. I've done some bad things in my life, things I'm not proud of. I promised someone that I loved that I would never go back to being that person. But for you, I'm going to make an exception. You ask me what I saw when I looked at you. What do you see when you look at me? How is he not scared he would just shoot him in the back right there? Oh! Senators, governors. Agent Mosley, please. Heard you found some money today. Check your personal email. Make sure you're sitting down when you do. Okay. Oh my gosh, this is why politics and everything is so freaking corrupt. He doesn't even run. I've lost tens of millions today alone. Oh no. Ralphie. Mr. McCall. Nikolai. And your life for theirs. Yes. Mr. McCall? They came into the store when we were closing. And they had guns. What's going on? Wait. Oh my god. <gasps> my men that will kill them in 30 minutes. Unless they're here in 29. Oh crap. He found his weakness. Compassion. You're willing to die for your friend. Are you? He's so smart. I love it. She's me. Where is that coming from? I don't know. So, which way is it coming from? The PA systems in the security office. The world he left behind. service doors in the back, okay? Go. They have arrived. Find the hostages. Well, this is handy. Hardware store where he knows where everything is. If it was me, I'd have to walk down 17 aisles before I find what I'm not looking for. You know what I was thinking? I don't think he's ever brought his own gun. Oh, sick. Oh, gosh. Okay. There are some gruesome deaths here. Oh, my heavens. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. He didn't just get him, did he? Oh, something very gross. Very innovative. hanging out the back of him. He literally has a knife hanging out the back of him. <gasps> Holy crap! This guy's like a viking! Okay, 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 okay. Get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him, get him! Ah, oh, please, 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 please. Oh boy. Oh boy. It's me! 
Mr. McCall. It's Ralphie. Fuck, uh, 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 90 my ass. <sighs> Ralphie! Come on. <gasps> Listen, I need you to do something, okay? Look at me. You make it to the breaker box. 40 seconds. Exactly. It's okay. It's okay. Come on, Ralphie. Come on, Ralphie. And do it so quiet. Oh, Pushkin, you say? Who are you? Everybody wants to know. Gun's not there, just put the towel on. What do you want? I want the head of the snake. Why isn't he scared? What do you gain from my dad? Peace. What is your price? He traded in his new balances. And I thought we weren't gonna see him take care of Pushkin until the next movie. But this means he has to redo his life all over again, right? He has to disappear again, he has to have a new identity, he has to... Think deep down she knows. So he doesn't have to make a new identity? Even though he killed like seven men in Home Mart? Well, that was gruesome. <laughs> And it reminded me so much of John Wick, but with more dialogue. You know, it's almost like they threw you in in the middle of the story, never really giving you his background or who those people were in the big house with political ties. And Bill Pullman, it just pulled his... He looks so old. He's... He's... While you were sleeping. <sighs> so it was kind of cool to see Denzel as this bad a money money killer vigilante guy i mean the story the russian mafia and all that was but i loved how they added some little things like just showing you his not only you know but also his brain and how he noticed little things that would help him in each scenario and then of course the home depot scene. <laughs> But it does intrigue me. I want to know more. I want to know what agency he worked for, how he got these skills, how he came to be. I want to see him and his wife. Equalizer too. I wouldn't say no, okay? I wouldn't say no. Even after all the bloodshed I just watched. 
I'm getting desensitized. Not actually, because those really did hurt my feelings, but. Shit, the barbed wire with the, and the, okay. Okay, thanks for watching, see you next time.